What's up guys, iPod Touch helping here and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how to jailbreak your iPod Touch 3G, iPod Touch 4th generation and your iPhone 3GS and your iPhone 4 and also your iPad 1st generation. So it only works for those devices but this will be able to jailbreak on 4.3 firmware. Alright, so you guys will need two things. All right, Number one is going to be Red Snow. All right, It's over here and you're also going to need a 4.3 firmware which you can download from this website right here and just scrolling down and finding your device and 4.3 firmware once you download it it should come as a zip file what you guys are going to want to do is highlight the zip part and just put IPSW so it's going to say 4.3 firmware or whatever dot IPSW and that'll change it to something that looks like this all right so once you have done that and you have both files on your computer you guys are going to want to make sure that you guys are on 4.3 firmware like I am right there as you guys can tell and uh, I'm on my iPod touch fourth generation and uh, unjailbroken right now so I will prove to you guys that this does work I'll even search for Cydia to prove that I'm not jailbroken right now and there we go I am unjailbroken right now guys so what you're gonna wanna do is open up Red Snow here just like that and you're gonna wanna click Red Snow and now it's gonna tell you to click for browse you're gonna browse for uh, something here and it, you're gonna browse for that uh, firmware that I told you guys to download like a minute ago so mine's on my desktop and there it is right there I can tell because that's a 4.3 one and uh, it's going to process the firmware here and IPSW successfully identified so I'm going to click next I'm not doing anything with my iPod yet sorry for the quality guys uh, wish I could make it a little bit better um, now you're going to have a few options you're going to definitely want to click install city at the top you're going to want to click enable battery percentage if you would like to and uh, that's all I'm going to do um, but uh, yeah that's pretty much it guys what you guys are going to want to do is pretty much just click next after this so I'm going to click next and now you guys are going to want to make sure that your device is turned off so there we go whoops I'm gonna fully power it off here there we go so my device is totally turned off and I'm not going to do the steps yet but what you guys are going to want to do is click next and it's going to say hold the power button for three seconds hold the home and power button for 10 seconds then release the power button and just hold the home button for 30 seconds so I'm going to do that right now alright so I'm getting ready to hold the power button right when I click next so one two three now I'm holding both the power and home button for about 10 seconds few more seconds left there there we go now I'm releasing the power button and holding the home button for about 15 seconds sometimes you have to do a little bit more of course I get a pop-up on my computer and uh, I'm just gonna keep on holding the home button here until I get this white screen and that's it you basically are done now it's just gonna do its thing and install Cydia onto your iDevice so it's as easy as that guys as you can tell it's downloading the jailbreak data now it's just uh, you know doing its thing and I'll stop you guys here this should be another screen that you guys get on your device once you're done uh, once all the letters are done popping up on your iDevice you get should get something that looks like a pineapple and uh, it's just gonna load up and install city on your device so my jailbreak has just finished guys and I'm gonna slide to unlock and there's city are right there it's got a white logo I'm gonna click on it and it's just gonna uh, prepare the file system for us and uh, it will exit and then um, I think you might have to respring your iDevice and then you can open up City after that but that's how you jailbreak your iPod touch iPhone and iPad on 4.3 or 4.3.1 firmware this was iPod touch helping here hopefully you guys like this video don't forget to rate comment and subscribe Peace.